And we've got one, uh, again, they're all very hard to see because it's a motley difference in there. Uh, but we can just see it's a sort of like a lighter brown colour against what are uh, sometimes black rocks. So you need to look at that for a little while and then every now and then you might see it move and that definitely gives it away as a fish. So I'm going to put these nymphs in front of it and get him to take it. No. Okay. One more. Oh, come, come. There we go. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. lovely. That was cool. We um, <laughs> get a bit deeper, I think. Yeah, to get that down for him to see it. Uh, cut the cast there. And I think that's exactly what it is. We talk about it often, you know, about getting that fly at the right depth for a nymph. And that's what it took. There was a, quite a few casts there until he actually saw it at his depth and, and then makes the choice, which is terrific. And it's just beautiful to get a, a fish, any fish is terrific, but it, just in this environment, I know I keep going on about it, but this is just amazing. I mean, you, you just don't get this in most parts of the world. So to walk up a, a valley like this, catch fish like this, it's just gold. And he's behaving pretty well, this fish, which is good. Here, there's not a lot of um, willows or anything to give us too much grief. The only things you have to be careful of are undercut banks and uh, we're pretty good here and he'll be ready in a sec he's still got a bit of go in him but uh, once he's ready i'll get his head up and shauna will uh, be able to get that net under him but the main thing is particularly at this time is not to panic we all want it in the net but we don't have to have it in the next 10 seconds so just use your rod and let the rod do all the work and let him fight against it tire him out and get him in the best position to get that net safely under him he, he likes that fast current and that's why they've got a bit more going it there's the water is as like uh, quite cold and very oxygenated and uh, it gives them plenty of energy and we're almost good to get him in there and beautiful gets him in there so uh, that's a good result in a stunning location like this and he's just a beautiful fish not the monsters that we're hoping for but uh, they're absolutely beautiful just the same and he's easily what 11 12 pound oh, yeah 13 yeah that's right. is that it? good that catch and release tool is just gold and just to show everyone at home what, what a stunning fish that is. I mean, the browns there are incredible. Spots, incredible. Originated um, these fish in particular from Tasmania and originally from the UK as well. And this is the perfect place for it. So, well done, champ. Thanks for the netting. Back. Woo! In time. All right. Now we'll just find another one. Okay. Yeah, cool.